Okay, so all in a matter of like an hour since that video went out, I reached out to the crease police on Twitter to get some advice. And so basically hugging the post is not super ideal in most situations. And you also have to challenge shots more now because the slot is pretty deadly. Camera left a comment saying don't commit to one side until the player can't cut back the other way, which... Not sure I understand that one. I kind of do, but... And we also got a comment here saying I need to butterfly a bit more. So, yeah, maybe I'll try that so here we go i honestly went to edit my equipment and i i don't know it the team colors it gave me just were not the team colors so I, i'm just gonna say screw it for now and i'm gonna simulate and we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna play okay so let's go ahead and sim we are up one nothing still one nothing so you know simulation me still has a shutout i severely doubt that actual me will follow through once again no objectives it's probably ideal to tell me I should save the puck, unless that's assumed, which also fair enough. I also got a question asking if I'm going to keep up the series this time and be active on it, and absolutely I will. If you guys keep watching it, that's the whole point. Like if I'm putting out Be A Pro videos and they're putting out basically no views compared to the other videos, then why would I keep posting it? Clearly people don't want to see it. I mean, obviously some people do, but not, you know, as much as the other videos. Oh yeah, nice pass. Ooh, what a save. Got it with the, the toenail there, it looked like. Will I receive my first shot of the contest? Well, not like my first shot of the contest, but my playing... S I was, I was there. I was literally there. My guy is just slow as anything. You won't score. Yep, I was right. You had pretty much that whole left side and decided to try and go bottom right. I am here to question your thought process. Oh, he's gonna score, isn't he? He's gonna walk out and he's gonna freaking score. Okay, well, not that time. Didn't get a shot either, but didn't score. Come on, take a shot that I can save for once. Of course. Of course he doesn't. I guess to be fair, there's no way of telling that I would have saved that. So, perhaps that just saved me from another goal. Nice, there we go. So, I'm not the only one that gets scored on from insanely weak shots in the slot there. It's not just me. And it was Tim again. Let's go, Timothy. So I'm seeing that you can actually get, like, it seems way faster now that you can move with that thing. So maybe I should try to challenge the shooter a little more and then just kind of do, like, a desperation on the, sh the pass, sorry, if they do end up getting it through. Okay, here we go. Am I going to get a shot? Yes, I am. And I saved it. That's huge. Believe it or not, guys, I saved a puck. Oh, that, <laughs> that probably would have been in. I'm only going to hug the post there, like, in that situation when we have control of the puck because it gets me plus or whatever for positioning so yeah i kind of want to do that but as soon as they grab it i'm getting off the thing here we go and i oh i really came out to challenge that one that came a little too far out for my comfort but maybe that's what i have to do i think i should should i turn off these like assist things too the the helper guide things maybe eventually for now until i get back into the swing of things i kind of like it just to you know get used to the whole process of being a tendy again am i gonna get another shot here oh I, he probably could have walked in and just taken a shot, but instead he tried to go cross crease, which doesn't shock me whatsoever. Here we go, and oh my word, how did I save that? That, I, I'm honestly very grateful that that was able to happen. Oh, another save, yo, I'm on fire right now. I was about to pass it out too. I'm getting a little too ahead of myself right now. Guy makes a couple saves, all of a sudden he thinks he can take risks. Like, no, we gotta play it safe here, chief. Go, 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 go. Put us ahead. Oh, that was cool. Normally in older games, they would have just taken a slap shot right then and there. All up in the goalie's grill too. So it's likely they're going to pull their goalie. There it is. Oh, never mind. They just put him back because we stole it. Nice. If I don't get another shot this entire game, aka the next 30 seconds, I will be fine with that. Oh no. Oh no. Yes. What a pick. Let's go. Who took? Oh, we got a penalty. Great. Thank you for that. I would love to be shorthanded with 18 seconds left. Okay, this is this is a nice face-off win. That's huge. That is absolutely massive. They might get one more shot off here. They just might. Nice, nice def- Oh, no! Are you kidding me? I don't have a physical copy of this game, but I'm willing to go buy one just to snap it in half. 1.9 seconds left as well. That is something you truly hate to see. Also, this time we get overtime. I, I get it. Totally understand the format. And we have 10 minutes of four on four. Then does it go to three on three? Is it that kind of thing? Honestly, that last goal though, I'm going to blame that on the defense because I had my guy. You know, I think goalie's supposed to take the shooter 
And then the defense should have had the guy in front of the net, which exhibit A, he did not. Nice. Okay, there we go. Big W. That is huge. Wait, did we like win the... Tr That's it? That We're done? Or are we just moving on or something? I did not mean to skip that celebration. Oh, well. I'll take that over what I got last time any day. Yeah, this time I do deserve some props. You know what? I think so. Played a lot better this time. Give me some hype. That time I deserve followers. So, makes sense. Sim to next event, off season. So, am I done here already or what's going on? Is over, would you like to continue simulating? Yes. What's, what's happening? All right, my agent wants to converse. Got an update on your, <laughs> what, what, what's the point of this? I don't even have a choice. So yeah, tell me, sure, why not? Your 33rd, last few chances. Okay, all right, I'll put more effort in. This will be pretty easy, you'll see. Well, they're both neutral anyway. I'll put a bit more effort into it, I suppose. Don't give up, I know you can make it. I'd honestly rather go early second round, because that means I go to a good team. Nope, I'm an idiot. I meant late first round. I do not want to go early second round. I can use the three points to add to conversation. That is new as well. <laughs> okay. So my guy's like a cinder block out there, so I'm going to go ahead and add some movement in there. Cross crease master, available three. Can I do that? I guess I can, sure. Where do I see how many points I have? Like, I don't, I don't know what's going on. I, I'm spending them. But I don't know what's, you know, how many I got left. Purchase, sure. But how many do I have left? Okay, now I'm officially out. I'm officially out because I can't buy anything. <laughs> they cut me off. All right, what's this all about? Last update on your draft. Okay, yep, I didn't do anything. So I didn't get a chance to do anything. Why? Okay, cool, thank you for that, I guess. For giving me the exact same information you gave me last time. How do I have four games played now? Did I simulate past games? They didn't give me the option to play them. I'm so lost. At least I'm up to 70 overall now. That's pretty hype. Oh, here we go. Draft lottery results. Okay. I don't think that makes too much of a difference to me. Well, I guess. New conversation with the Senators. Oh, okay. Here we go. I will... Okay, so... I am GM Melanie Ladd. I'm gonna ask you a few questions to get to know you better. Ready to begin. Absolutely. Okay, your teammates invite you out, but you may not make curfew if you go out. Do you go with them? That's a tough one. How do I answer that? I not, if I have a game the next day, wouldn't want to let my teammates down. Without a doubt, who am I to say no? As long as I can do so responsibly. Okay, so that's 50-50. This one has no impacts. I I wouldn't want to let the teammates down, I guess. But at the same time, like, you know, be responsible. Go out, have some fun. Okay, great to see you take preparation seriously. How do you spend your free time before games? I try to relax, don't want to waste my energy. I eat right and get some rest, but I don't sit around. I watch highlights of the previous game to see what I did right. <laughs> wow, what a dick. I was gonna say, I yeah, that one. The eat right one. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, didn't like that. Uh, if I talk to your previous coaches, would they recommend we draft you? No, I sure hope so. I've always tried to do whatever I could to help my team win. Yeah, there we go. It's gotta like that one, right? Okay, plus 87. We'll ask them. I think they'll have good things to say. Thanks for your time. You are very welcome. I like how there's actual like facial reactions and stuff. This is great. This is a big step for NHL. All right, next, who's interviewing me? The Sharks. Okay, I'm Jim Brandon Sharks. I'm going to ask you a few questions to get to know you better. Ready to begin? I'd love to. Uh, when you're on the ice, what's the best feeling for you as a player? Nothing beats knowing I can be the best player on the ice. Okay. Winning is always great. Knowing I left it all out there on the ice and tried my best. That sounds like, no, you kind of want to win. Winning is always great. Also sounds kind of, you know, like you're not serious about it. Uh, honestly, I think I'm going to go with this one. I just gave it my all and that's that's it. Do you keep in touch with your parents while you were away? Uh, we would talk occasionally. We kept in touch. They wanted to make sure I was behaving myself all the time. They're my biggest supporters. Yeah, there we go. Absolutely. That's an interesting way of putting it. Would you consider yourself a team player? Of course I am. I'm all about putting the team first. 
course, I wouldn't want to let my teammates down. If being the best player makes you a team player, then sure I am. Uh, yeah, let's put, this, let's put the squad first, you know? Okay, that's plus seven. And we got a plus 87 with Ottawa. I'm confused. What did I do wrong? A different approach this time. Okay, the Anaheim Ducks, Nora Carney. I'm gonna ask you a few questions. Sure. You have an important game coming up. How do you prepare? Okay. So, oh, there is different answers this time. Interesting. Let's try to focus a little more. I need that extra edge. Uh, the same as every other game. Okay, wait, an important game. Try to change up my routine. I try not to change up my routine. I focus a little more. I need that extra edge. Sure, let's go with that one. Interesting. Uh, you don't always prepare to play your hardest. Oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, what do you bring to the team? You know what? I don't want to be drafted by your team now. If you're going to be like that. Uh, nothing but raw skill and talent. I'm a great team guy. Awesome locker room guy. I bring a hardworking attitude and I'm determined to win. Sure, let's go with that. And that's good to hear. Does it frustrate when your teammates turn the puck over? Uh, it happens to everyone. No hockey's a game of mistakes. I like to see my teammates trying to make plays. It's incredibly frustrating. I'm going to go with this one because, you know, hockey's a very fast game, so it is a game of mistakes, realistically. And it's seeing them try to make plays and, you know, at least putting an effort forth, it's good enough for me. So, okay, that was quite the interview. I got plus 47 from them. What did I do so right in the Ottawa one? This one I got a green flashing message. The other one I got a red message. I don't know what to tell you. Unless this is like golf and the lower the score the better, but that doesn't make sense because it wouldn't be green with a plus symbol then. Here we go. All right, Tino, it's the big day. With your performance, you're projected to be picked around 33rd. Are you excited? So this is the third time now. I get it. Three times, three, three. Makes perfect sense. I'll join another awesome team. I know I'm up for, uh... I know I'm up for more though. What does that even mean? I'm just gonna go with this one. Uh, no matter which NHL team drafts you, you'll learn a lot from them. Yep, so this was kind of a pointless engagement. However, I will take it. All right, so in this video, we're gonna find out where I get drafted to. So I wasn't in the DEL for very long, but here we go. So I don't know whether to skip or if I should just let it play through. I think I'm gonna let it play through. Oh, here we go. And number, oh, end of first round, okay. Yep, and am I gonna go 33? I am, yeah. So clearly, the higher the number was better. Ottawa liked me. Great, now I gotta compete with Matt Murray. This is awesome. I guess it could have been worse though. Oh yeah. This is fire. I am all about this. Okay, sweet. So there we go, drafted, it's official. I am a senator. And I'm actually, you know what? I'm super down with that. The moves they've been making recently and they just went back to their old jerseys and logo, which not in this game, but if I go in there, I'm, I'm using those damn jerseys, so. Absolutely. Oh, am I going to have a, a teammate interaction here? What's going on? I'm walking into the dressing room and there's no one there. It's a ghost town. So no, not exactly. I see. I see. They put it up there so you can't step on it. That's smart. I like that. Do I get my own stall and everything? I guess I would have to. It's kind of, you know, part of being on the team, but I'm also 72 overall. So <laughs> very easily could be cut. Okay, this is intense. There's a lot of conversations going on here. Not a first round pick, but not the last one, right? With a big opportunity of playing in Ottawa. Uh, sure, the important thing was being picked and now I have to get ready for the NHL. These are the things we all dream about as kids. Yeah, not the spot I imagined I would be in, but this franchise is amazing and I have a lot to bring to it. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. Okay, that makes management happy, I would assume. Now we look forward to seeing you in action. Do you expect to get a lot of ice time in the preseason? I only have star answers. So I think the coach can give minutes to other players. No problem with that. He already knows I will kill it. Uh, yes, I do. I'm valuable in any given moment, be it preseason or the playoffs. I should always play. I. It's a good answer. Okay, the same guy. Lots of questions. So sure, yeah, no worries. My brand went up 200, so that's neat. And is that going to be the end of this one? It's literally just been nonstop cutscenes. I haven't been able to do anything. Now I have a meeting with the GM. So here we are. We met a few weeks ago before the draft. I'm Clara Bieksa, GM of the Ottawa. GM of Ottawa. Never mind. There's no the in there. GM of Ottawa, in case you forgot. <laughs> I don't think I would have forgotten that. But anyway, on behalf of the entire organization, I want to formally welcome you to the team. Thank you. I'm really excited. Okay. We've been watching your performance through the tournament. 
but I wanted to ask you personally, how do you describe yourself as a player? I'm a team player at heart. I love working together with my teammates. I'm a flexible player. I can adapt depending on the situation. And oh, okay, so it's up there. I got team like ability, management like ability, or brand. So I'm going to I'm going to bond with the boys first here, okay? That's my first move. So let's end that conversation and yeah, there we go. So plus 100 to teammates. Yo, I am going to be so furda. It's ridiculous. Stop with the conversations. Let me get to next season. You just have to sign your entry level contract. Yeah, let me see the contract. Here it is. 0.85. So 850k for 3 years. That's pr pretty standard, I guess. Entry level deal. And yeah, I think we're good. So that was not that important. If I have to do one more conversation before we get to the next game, I'm going to lose it. How do I already have 234,000 followers? Is that a joke? Can my boy like broadcast a message to subscribe to Man of the Rid or what? I didn't do anything. I just had the off season and I gained like 40,000 more followers. This is easy. I still have two specialty points available and three purchasable traits. So I'm going to try to spend everything I can. I don't really know. Oh, they're at the top right there. I finally see where they are. Okay, so I have two SP available, which means I can't buy one of these. Oh, so it's basically just for this, but I'm going to wait to try and unlock another one. So never mind. So obviously I'm going to have to update my equipment, even though it was clearly just updated in that little cutscene there with me sitting in the dressing room. And then I came over here and all of a sudden I'm just... That was like a quick change. Very impressive. Once again, these can be changed later. So I just went with random team ones for now. So I was planning to do two games in this one, but the dialogue and everything ended up taking way longer than I thought. So yeah, I guess let's view the lines here. I'm assuming I hate having to do the preseason though. The preseason absolutely stinks. And defense. Okay, we, <laughs> we're not going to do very well. I'm just throwing that out there now, but... You know, there I am, backing up Matt Murray. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I did perform a little bit better in the one game today, so that's nice. Hopefully, I can keep that up and then just keep improving. That's what I'm hoping for here. So, yeah, be sure to drop a like. Click that sub button if you can. I mean, it takes half a second, so you can. You definitely can. If you got here, you can do that. But yeah, I appreciate you guys for watching. Hope it was entertaining for y'all, and I will see you whenever I upload next, so probably pretty soon.